Hello friends, welcome to NJCT. We are learning social science of 10th standard and we have started with the very first chapter of your syllabus that is heritage of India. In the previous video we talked about natural heritage and cultural heritage. Even we talked about cultural heritage of Gujarat. Now in this video we will talk about fads of Gujarat. Gujarat has diversity in culture. It is famous for its beaches, temple town, historic capitals, wildlife, centuries, hill resorts, etc. Varied culture of Gujarat is seen in many places. Hence, fads having traditional, religious and social importance are held. There are many places in Gujarat where different kind of fairs are held. We will talk about some important fairs among them. So first of all let's talk about Modhera fair. Place of this fair is Modhera in Mehsana district and mostly it is held in the third week of January. So it is the incredible festival of dance. As we know that Modera temple is famous as Sun Temple. Then the second one is Bahucharaji Fair. It is held in Bahucharaji in Mahstana district and it is held on Chaitra Sud Puna. Chaitra is the Gujarati month. So, Bhaujaraji is the famous place for Bhaujara Mata Mandir. It is said that Bhaujarma killed demon king Dandasur with Trishul and brought peace for gods and people on the earth. It is also believed that Bahu, which means hand, Bahu of Ma Devi Sati was fallen here at Bhaujaraji temple. Thus it is also popular Shakti Peet. Then the next one is Shamlaji Fair. It is held in Shamlaji in Arvalli district. And this festival and this fair is celebrated during Kartak Sud Ekadashi to Punam. It is said that Lord Brahma once embarked on a journey to find out the best Tirtha on the earth. After seeing a number of places, he came to Shamalaji, which he liked the most, and then he performed Pinanans there for a thousands of years. It is also famous festival in Gujarat. Then we will talk about Bhadarvi Punam Fair. It is held in Ambaji in Banaskantha district and it is always held on Bhadarvi Punam. Bhadarvi Punam Fair is a very important and big fair. Large number of shops selling Prasadi, Chundri, Shrefal, Kanku, Pushpa are seen. Crowd are also seen. Food stalls are also set up on a temporary basis. There are variety of shops for toys and bangles. Then the next one is Bhavanath Mahadev Fair. This fair is held in Girnar in Junagar district. And time of fair is Meghavad Naomi to Amas. Lord Bhavnath is worshipped at the midnight of Mahashivratri. A large number of monks and Naga Sadhus come from all over Gujarat to pay homage to Mahapuja. And this place is a place of faith and belief for the people of Ahir and Mer tribe. Pop music, Raskarba and Bhajan Kirtan programs are also organized at night during the fair. 
Then the next one is Tarnetar Fair, which is very famous and it is held in Surendranagar district and it is held for three days every year during the Hindu calendar month Bhadarbo. Based on the legend of Draupadi's Swayamvar, this fair is a celebration of Gujarat's folk dance, music, costumes and art. Then the next one is Bhadiyad Fair which is held in Ahmedabad district and time of this fair is during Rajab month. The next one is Naklang Fair. This fair is held in the district of Bhavnagar and Tithi of this fair is Bhadarva Vad Amas. It is said that Pandavas established Naklang Mahadev on New Moon Night in the month of Bhadarva. Then Madhavpur Fair. It is held in Madhavpur in Porbandar district and this fair is held from Naomi to Teras. It is said that Madhavpur is one place where Lord Krishna married Rukmini. Then Vrutha fair, it is held in Dholka in Ahmedabad district and it is held on Kartak Sud Punam. Vrutha fair is the largest fair in Ahmedabad district. The main attraction of this fair is the donkey market. The best and highest quality donkeys are brought here for sale and the Vanjara community brings more than 4,000 donkeys for sale here. Camels are also traded at the Vrutha fair and donkeys are painted red, pink and orange on the neck and back. The next one is Miradatar fair which is celebrated in Mahasana district and it is also celebrated during Rajab month. Then the next one is Dang's Darbar Fair which is celebrated in Ahava in Dang district and this fair is celebrated on Paralgun Sud Poonam. Dang Darbar takes place in the Saputara Hills Tribal dances of this region are spectacular to watch. For visitors to Dang, this festival is a great opportunity to see tribal communities like Bhil, Kumbis, Varlis and the Gamits in their traditional attire. Then the next one is Gol Gadeda Fair. This fair is held in Dahod district and it is celebrated for 5 to 7 days after Holi. This fair is celebrated by young Bill women. The next one is Kartak Punima fair. It is held in Somnath in Gir and this fair is held on Kartak Sud Punam. Starting from Dev Diwali till Kartak Purnima every year. The last one is Banguria Fair which is held in Quant in Chota Udaipur and this fair is celebrated from Holi to Rangapanchini. This fair is also known as Quant Fair. Uh, this fair is a fair of Rathwa tribe of Chota Udaipur area. You can see here that tribal youth are seen dancing with drums and other musical instruments. Tribal men and women wear a bucket of peacock feather on their head and use it to express their love for birds. So you can see variety of fairs and each fair has their own uniqueness and their own importance. Now in the next video we will talk about land 
एंड पीपल ऑफ इंडिया